Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for AMC Entertainment Holdings. The report was first published on our website January 28, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about AMC Entertainment Holdings for the upcoming trading day on Monday 31st, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current AMC Entertainment Holdings performance to better understand the where the stock is right now. In our systems, the AMC Entertainment Holdings stock currently holds a minus 3.488 score, and our system has ranked AMC Entertainment Holdings sell candidate since December 22, 2021. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 47.49%. This is an average return of minus 1.83% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for AMC Entertainment Holdings our last headline reads, Volatile ride for AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc. stock price on Friday moving between $13.40 and $15.25. The AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc. stock price gained 3.72% on the last trading day, Friday, January 28, 2022, rising from $14.52 to $15.06. During the day the stock fluctuated 13.81% from a day low at $13.40 to a day high of $15.25. The price has fallen in 9 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 27.11% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 3 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 54 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $806.15 million. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $72.62, and the lowest price was $5.26. Right now the price is 79.26%, or $57.56, .56, below 52-week high at $72.62, which also is all-time high for the stock. The AMC Entertainment Holdings Stock Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the stock, but first the trends. The stock lies in the lower of a very wide and falling trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at $14.09 is broken, it will firstly indicate a stronger fall rate. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 55.81% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 52.03% and minus 30.89%. The 12-month trend it indicates a 46% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between 48.37% and 673.07%. This equals a price between $22.34 and $116.43 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, November 17, 2021 Citigroup set target to $5 to $6. On Thursday, November 4, 2021 Wedbush set target to $7.50. On Thursday, August 19, 2021 Citigroup set target to $3.70 to $5. On Thursday, August 12, 2021 Wedbush set target to $7.50. From analysts AMC Entertainment Holdings stock received a general neutral rating. The analysts give P-E ratio a strong sell and price to book a strong sell rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the AMC Entertainment Holdings stock a neutral rating. In this section, we will give you some information about signals found for AMC Entertainment Holdings. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Thursday, January 27, 2022, 
and so far it has risen 3.72%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short term development. The AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc. stock hold sell signals from both short and long term moving averages, giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long term average is above the short term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $16.32 and $23.48. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a sell signal. Pivots gave a buy signal two days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 42 days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal two days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a sell signal 47 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 43 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average gave a sell signal 21 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 47 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 42 days. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for AMC Entertainment Holdings AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc. finds support from accumulated volume at $14.52 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $1.85 between high and low, or 13.81%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 14.69%. The stock has a beta of 1.83. This tells us that AMC Entertainment Holdings is 0.83 times more volatile than the market. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for AMC Entertainment Holdings. The price to earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. AMC Entertainment Holdings currently has a price earning ratio of minus 3.86. A negative high price to earnings ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even the most established companies experience down periods, which may be due to environmental factors that are out of the company's control. However, companies that consistently show a negative price-to-earnings ratio are not generating sufficient profit and run the risk of bankruptcy. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, AMC Entertainment Holdings meets first resistance at $15.94. If you do not hold AMC Entertainment Holdings shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn AMC Entertainment Holdings finds first level of support at $14.52 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $13.86, $13.43, Sell at $15.28, $15.71, The average ratings combined from several analyst sources or AMC Entertainment Holdings is neutral. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On January 14, 2022 Ellis Daniel E. made an inside sell of 40,788 of class A common stock. On January 13, 2022 Colinero Stephen A. made an inside sell of 50,588 of class A common stock. 
On January 12, 2022 Cox Chris A made an inside sell of 20,000 of class a common stock. On January 12, 2022 McDonald John D made an inside sell of 75,000 of class a common stock. On January 11, 2022 Aaron Adam M made an inside sell of 312,500 of class a common stock. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 39.766. In total, the insiders bought 1,701,833 and sold 4,110,071 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is AMC Entertainment Holdings stock a buy? AMC Entertainment Holdings Inc. holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a strong sell to a sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Monday 31st we expect AMC Entertainment Holdings to open down negative 49 cents and start trading at $14.57. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.